All right, everybody, we are still trying to figure out this Osmo Pocket. Right now it's uh, <clears throat> not independent. It is with the cell phone. So it's kind of a bulky setup. I would like to learn how to do it just with the uh, Osmo Pocket so it's smaller. But this is just a test for vlogging. So right now we're just walking through uh, our neighborhood. Got some nice trails. There goes a dove. Hope you saw that. Yeah. So right over here is um, this is a wetland preserve here in Hillsborough, Oregon. So our neighborhood backs up to this wetland preserve, so no homes. It gets pretty flooded in the uh, winter time, but in the summertime it dries out and there's trails down there. I actually did a video on it. Um, I'll put a link up there of Jackson Bottom Wetland. I, know, I want to try something here. Just want to check out some of this quality. That's where we came from. We got you got eagles down there. You got cranes, so all sorts of birds and ducks and stuff. They have some eagle nests uh, on the trails over there. Pretty cool. But yeah, it's a wildlife preserve. Better shot of it. Yeah, we do this walk every day on our uh, Instagram. You can follow us at Bitcoin Kev, Bitcoin Kev on Instagram. We're doing this uh, walk. We get out, we get up off the couch, try to stay active. Uh, we're, we have a goal set of staying active 365 days. And... Uh, Currently, we are on day 115. You're on our walk with us. 115 of 365 days. But this is basically the walk we do. It's about two miles through the neighborhood. This is Arbor Roses here in Hillsborough, Oregon. development probably uh, I don't know 2009 ish maybe these houses up here they're brand new they came in uh, last year used to be a big open field but anywhere there's a big open field there's new houses And they put their own trail in behind their development, so kind of ties into our neighborhood. It's pretty, pretty nice, pretty sweet. Gives us some options to walk around. But uh, I'm gonna pause the video here real quick, and we're gonna do our vlog for our Instagram. So I'll be right back. All right, the vlog is complete. I don't know if you can call that a vlog. It's like 30 seconds of us just being accountable and checking in. Today is 105, April 15th, Monday, and it's tax day. So I hope you got your taxes done. Another look at the wetlands over there. This is the trail we're coming up. 
pretty nice. It's a great little little trail just to get out and walk around. But just want to do, you know, check the uh, stability and uh, how it's how it operates. I did another Osmo Pocket uh, video a couple weeks ago with the cherry blossoms. I don't know if I had the settings wrong or what, but it sure didn't come out 4K like I was hoping it to. And there's a link up here. Check that one out. But some redwoods, cedar. Getting eaten up by the ivy on the ground. We are in the Pacific Northwest. Little pond over here. Some ducks swimming around. But yeah, this is our walk. Just part of it. I'm not gonna. Well, we'll just we'll go up to the neighborhood. This is a road now, but if we continue to go that way, we will come back into the development. Pretty peaceful out here. Light rain. The Osmo Pocket is definitely not waterproof. I guess they do make a waterproof case, but it's not raining that hard. It's just drop here and there. If it was raining hard, we'd be under an umbrella or we wouldn't be doing this at all. up there for sale. I think they want some crazy money for that. Over 400000 or so. Crazy! But that's what happens when you live in the Pacific Northwest. It's all good for us. I mean, as far as the market goes, it stays up. We're going to make a profit. Buying a house is definitely an investment. But yeah, now we're back into the neighborhood. And we just keep walking around. It's pretty big. I don't know how many houses are in here. But there is a uh, pool, clubhouse, weight room. With the HOA, you know, they, they do the maintenance on the yards and things like that. Pretty quiet place, pretty new. It's gotten some awards for the beauty. But anyway, I'm gonna end it here. So, there's some free stuff if you need some, something. Yeah, we'll just walk up to the corner and we'll shut her down. You know, it's kind of boring, but you know, you gotta get used to these kind of things. If you're gonna be using them out in the field, you gotta know what you're doing. And, uh, you know, just watch YouTube, how to do it, how to use it. Watching other guys and tips and tricks. So, anyway, hope you enjoyed this little walkabout. Where this is a cul-de-sac, we're gonna come around, come back, but. I'm going to end it right here. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Have a good one. Bye-bye. Okay, guys. I have disconnected the phone from the DJI Osmo Pocket. So I'm just using this guy independently. We 
hear the sirens in the background. That's not good. Anyway. So yeah, we're being independent with the Osmo. Okay. No phone attached. Just kind of trying things out here. The one thing I can't figure out is how to flip the camera around. You guys say double tap the right button a couple times and it should flip. So once we get through here, I will attempt that. Look at these nice flowers. Coming out to the uh, entrance of the development. We got a nice pond up here. A lot of water stuff around here, which is cool. All right, now that we're out of the uh, tunnel there, this is the uh, entrance into the development, Harbor Roses. So now, after the bus goes by, we're gonna flip this guy around, see how we do selfies on this. Hey, look at that. I just double tapped that and it flipped around. And uh, yeah, let's flip her back. know how to flip it back. There it goes. Took me a couple tries to flip that around. Best way to learn this stuff is just play around with it. Hopefully it won't break it. These are a little spindy. Last week or a week and a half ago, these were all flowers over here, all budding cherry blossoms. Now all the flowers are gone. Now there's a little bit up there still. But yeah. Keep walking to the clubhouse and I'll kind of show you that. We won't go inside, but you can rent it out for parties and such. Which is, we've done that a couple times. Big space, big space. I think the pool opens in May. We have a playground basketball court. The playground just recently got some uh, like turf for it's not it's not real grass below the playground. It's like turf and it's soft for kids if they fall or whatever. Still some flowers over there on that tree. But Might speed this up or slow it down. See how it goes. Right over there is the playground for the kids. Full cost. Well, I just want to go over there real quick. Just kind of show people what's up here. 
Arbor Roses. So yeah, there's the playground, picnic tables, and over here, uh, that's the clubhouse. Pretty, pretty modern, pretty, uh, they just remodeled it last summer actually. There's the pool, it's closed right now. You got a big pool, a kiddie pool, and a hot tub. And in those windows over there, you got the gym. And then over here is the basketball court. Well, yeah. This is Arbor Roses with the test of the DJI Osmo Pocket. All right, thanks guys. We'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.